Welcome to Data Push, and these are the top tech stories for March 14th, 2017. So Nintendo has sold about 1.5 million copies of the Nintendo Switch. Now these aren't official Nintendo numbers, these are garnered from a third party that kind of did some math, bringing in the numbers that Best Buy and places like that have sold, but it's a great showing for a Nintendo console, considering the Wii U sold way fewer than that. Of course the Wii U was kind of a total waste of a console generation, but I get ahead of myself. The Nintendo Switch is doing great, and that's what we should take away from it. I hope all of you are enjoying playing it. Let me know down in the comments your favorite game. I mean, out of the two that you could play right now. Let me know. Now, Visa has come up with a new contactless version of Pain. What do I mean by that? Well, Visa has, you know, the Visa cards that you swipe at, at cashier stations and stuff like that. The new one that they're prototyping, they're actually gonna prototype it at a surfing event, is a pair of sunglasses. So it's gonna have all of the information built into the side of the sunglasses, so you'll have to take them off to actually hit the chip on them, or you can slam your face into the register, you know, whatever you prefer. But it's gonna be pretty cool. We'll see how it works, and of course this is filling a niche that isn't really there yet, but maybe you're on a beach and you're not carrying your wallet, you can still pay for things. But of course, if you ever lose your sunglasses, you're out of luck. You lost your sunglasses, and all your credit cards, and information to all your banking. So, there's that. Now, For Honor, or Ubisoft, is cracking down on cheaters. They previously have banned 1,500 users from cheating. Now, the most common form of cheating in For Honor, which is an extremely popular game, is what is called AFK XP farming. Basically, away from keyboard, experience point farming. Users are taking rubber bands, rubber banding their joystick joystick in a spinning direction and then walking away from the game. Basically making sure that their character is constantly moving so they don't get timed out of the server and then finishing a game and taking in the XP from finishing a game. Now it's awful and it's cheating and, and Ubisoft is taking note. They are releasing 4,000 players who have been found to be AFK cheating. They're releasing some warnings. If you get caught a second time, you're done. They've already banned 1,500 players so just be on the lookout for that. Don't cheat people. It's not fun. It's not fun for you. It's not fun for anybody else. You bought a video game to play it. Play the video game. Thank you so much for checking out Data Push for March 14th, 2017. Of course, check out the store. Get these awesome t-shirts. And if you like the video, press the like button and subscribe to the channel so you never miss a Data Push. Thank you very much.